everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to uh, talk about something that is actually not really news anymore because I'm a little bit late telling you this, but I'm sure everyone uh, who watches this already knows by now, but I wanted to talk about it anyway, so hear me out. <laughs> So the article I want to talk about was like widely uh, spread over all Belgian newspapers, of course, um, and it was about the victory of a Belgian tennis player, um, Elise Mertens, who teamed up with a Taiwanese player, uh, Xie Su Wei. Don't kick me if I pronounce that wrong, please. But they formed a duo and they won at Wimbledon against a, a Russian duo. So let's get into the article. So the article I'm looking at today uh, is on the Belgium VRT News. It's one of our main news channels. And it says, Xie Su Wei of Taiwan won her third Wimbledon title in women's doubles after partnering with Elise Mertens of Belgium to beat Russian duo Veronika Kudermetova and Elena Vesnina, the Associated Press reports. So first of all, I'm super excited because how cool is that? It's like a Taiwanese and a Belgian player who made like the best duo ever. That's amazing news. And they also performed really well. As they say here in the article, Xie and Mertens uh, saved two match points in the second set and won 3-6, 7-5 and 9-7. They clinched a back and forth third set when Xie hit a backhand winner to break Vesnina's serve. So if you don't know who Xie Su Wei is, she's actually very, very famous in the tennis world. And uh, she has so, 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 so many victories already. Uh, and especially in duos, she performs so well. So I think it would be great if we take a look at Xie Su Wei's uh, Wikipedia page, because I think she has such an amazing and crazy career. Um, of course, I'm not gonna tell you all the prizes she's won because that's just too much to name. But Xie Su Wei was born on 4th of January 1986 and she's a Taiwanese professional tennis player. She has won three single titles. Oh, okay. So here they're gonna list all kind of titles and medals that she's won. It's really a long list. If you wanna take a look at it, you can open Wikipedia yourself because I'm not gonna read all of that. Um, and she reached world number one in the doubles rankings for the first time. Um, I think that was in 2014. So she's really, really famous in the tennis world. She has amassed over 9.5 million in prize money. Uh, known for playing with two hands on both sides, flat and quick ground strokes, crafty gameplay, aggressive volleys, an unorthodox variety of shots, she is regarded as one of the most successful and versatile double players in history. She has won four Grand Slam titles in doubles, claiming the 2013 Wimbledon Championships and the 2014 French Open with Peng Shui. Um, yeah, and then they keep going on with many things that she has won. While she is primarily known for her doubles prowess, she has also found success on the singles tour. Most of her singles success has come on hard courts, where she has won all three of her WTA titles, as well as reached the quarterfinals at the Australian Open in 2021. So she has just such an amazing career. And I was very happy to hear that she was teamed with our Belgian player, um, who is, I think, not as well known, Elise Mertens. But yeah, it was just so awesome to see this uh, Taiwanese-Belgium duo. As you know, I am from Belgium and I just have such a big love for Taiwan. So all things um, connecting Taiwan and Belgium is just something so happy for me. So I hope you also enjoyed this news that is not really news because it's old news. <laughs> 
So I'm very curious to hear, did you also see the game? And what did you think about it? I know that here in Europe, people were more busy watching football because uh, Belgium had just been kicked out <laughs> uh, of the league by uh, Italy. And we were watching, I was in Italy watching the final between Italy and uh, England. And I'm super happy that Italy won. Uh, especially being in Italy, it was such a great uh, atmosphere to be there while they won. But anyway, why am I getting suddenly into football right now? I was talking about tennis. Uh, so thank you so much for watching this news that is not news because it's old right now. But anyway, I was very excited to talk about it. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this little video and oh, if you sticked around until the end, let's choose a password. Uh, let's say tennis ball. If you write tennis ball in the comments down below, then I know that you sticked around until the end. And uh, yeah, thank you so much for that. <laughs> uh, don't forget to like and subscribe and I hope to see you super soon in the next video. Bye bye.